Hey guys, it's Tom here with MYT Solar. Finishing up an install here on this 25 RDS Outdoors RV. It's a titanium trim. Customer all the way from Massachusetts over here in Oregon picking up their trailer from us here with a pretty big system that they can take home with them. So I'll show you inside. We've done a few of these now, but this will be the first, I believe, first 25 RDS with the game changers. Two of the GC3 270 amp hour game changers over here. 540 amp hours, it's a 12 volt system. Customer got the Orion DC to DC charger, so that's something a little different today. Nice big 250 85 charge controller. We've got 1200 watts on the roof. Nice, nice size charge controller for a good size solar array. Links distributor, class T fuse, disconnect, shunt, all the good stuff. Servo for the Touch 50, which is right here in this window, in this door, I should say. Just been doing my programming here. Back to the main screen, showing all our info. Shore power coming in, AC loads. Got the air conditioner running now, so we can see 1412 watts, which is pretty much being pulled by the air conditioner. Customer has the DC fridge upgrade, which is awesome. Luckily, hey, they have that solar and lithium power to match that. What else? I'll show you our DC to DC connection out the front and I'll show you our solar panels on the roof. Alrighty, customer wanted that Orion, that DC to DC charger. What that's gonna do, tomorrow when they pick up the trailer, we're gonna run a line of cable through their truck with a connector on it, which will be the opposite of this. So when they connect up their seven pin for their lights and their brakes and whatnot, they're also gonna hook up this DC to DC charger line so they can charge safely from the alternator in their, their new 2023 GMC. One of the things you'll notice, this is the size of the wire that we're going to run on the DC to DC. We're going to use four gauge wire. Inside of this, this is their umbilical cord, there's also a charge line, but that charge line, there's seven wires in just this, there's seven wires in here, two wires here. You can see, imagine how much smaller that wire would be, which is why we have to upgrade this wire for, for, for solid charging from the truck. Even though the 25 RDS has an option for a 50 amp, the customer just went with the one air conditioner, which means 30 amp rig. The original Multi Plus 3000 12 volt system, right here in the pass through, drop pass through, pretty tucked away. Everything's pretty secured here and supported. These cables won't get in the way too much. This thing's nice and rock solid. It takes up some pass through space, but it saves a bit of space inside. All right, so 1200 watts of solar up here, the 200 watt rich mega panels, the 48 volt panels. Six of these guys up here in a two, three series, two parallel configuration. Got the soft start in the Coleman air conditioner here. We installed that. Currently running that air conditioner off that battery bank right now. Not a lot of sun, unfortunately, to be replacing those amp hours. But at least it's a nice feature to be able to run that air conditioner from your battery bank. No generator, quiet power. That's kind of what we do. Really happy with this install. This is a 2.5 RDS outdoors RV. We're MYT Solar, and if there's any way we can help you with any of your solar needs. If you've got an outdoors RV, great. We love to specialize in those, but we can help, help you with any solar project. Shout out.